Hello, water sun, dude, last my kind. God damn it, I just totally put everything. Okay, never mind. Water suns, you're the last one up for Shadow of Judgment. Yay. For anybody who is new to my channel, let me turn this down because that is actually kind of loud. Okay, that's better. For anyone who's new to my channel, this is Shadow of Judgment. This is where I look at the uh, nooks, the crannies, what goes on in the circle and what goes around it. The four corners, if you will, to see what's going on for your week, to see what is happening, what's in the subconscious, what's on, going on on the shadow, what you don't know about, what you might be scheming or what someone might be scheming against you. You know, all in secret, of course. Anyway, Water Signs, you're the last ones to get your readings this week for the 30th to the 5th of September. So, Water Signs, this is for a sun moon rising and venus and jupiter and jupiter my bad almost forgot check your charts if this resonates with you good deal if not do not worry about this water signs after all it's just a card game it won't come true if you don't believe in it right so just boop your nose enjoy the show and keep the leave the cons and don't keep the pros i was thinking of something poetic and then i realized it was totally backwards so that's my bad anyway Cancer, you're up first. Actually, hold up. What's your card for this week, actually? Ah, Ten of Pentacles reverse, y'all. Hmm. Right that, right there. Boop. I need to make some more little thumbnails for this just so I can eliminate some shit. But that's your uh, card for the week. Ten of Pentacles reverse. So, Cancer, you're up first. Let's see what's going on with this my loves let's see what is going on for cancer for the 30th of august the 2 september 5th yes yes let's see someone's at a crossroads with whatever and there is justice to be had it could be libra it could be pisces whichever one right but there's definitely some Wow, major arcana energy for sure. Some shit is moving for you guys. Ah, uh, someone. Oh dear, cancer. What the fuck? You might have caused somebody to walk away from you that you didn't mean to. You know, yeah, at a crossroads with your shit, and this person might have walked away because that was the right, just thing to do, right? Hmm, interesting. Um, no love's being given in this situation. Either to the person who, um, did this shit or whatever. There's a leap of faith being taken when it comes to justice. Taking a fool's journey. Someone might have offered. Something could be a Capricorn, a Taurus, or Virgo. Ew. Ew. Cancer. Cancer. Yup. That's a no. That, that's, I'll tell you right now, that's a no. That's a no. <laughs> okay. What? Okay, so then what was the point of, like, offering the fucking pentacle to begin with? Like, the fuck, you know? We got three cards right here. Someone was being control freak a little bit too much or was pushing out their authority a little bit too much to somebody they had a relationship with in the past. And, you know, that was some sneaky sneak shit. That was a sneaky sneaker Jake shit. You know, some dirty sneaks, if you will. Um, cancer, so let's see what's going on. Oh, yes. Cross watchers, switch where you need to, of course. No biggie. That shit happens. It's all up to you how you see things, right? But, Cancer, it seems like, a You or whoever you're dealing with is at a crossroads where it's almost like... They have to yield something... It looks like what they're yielding is not, like, either not giving away their cup or just being an immature prick. It's one of the two. One of the two. And that's because the more that they're, like, being a prick or whatever or acting the way that they're acting is only hurting themselves and they're recognizing this with the Nine of Swords as well. It's like they should be trying to get out of this mentality, but it's, like, plaguing them, right? Um... 
This person who played some head games and like they won a few games, but then they lost the war. It's like they try to offer something that is valuable, but it's like as soon as it's offered, they back out of it because it's like like it's a slow moving offer, but then they jump back just as quickly as they start moving, uh, and that's causing them a lot of issues, right? Because they're trying to bring like they're trying to be booty card man and bring this temperance where two people could come together could be a libra involved here who wants to take a leap of faith but they aren't really offering anything in fact do might have gone for the door or cancer you could have been going for the door just being like you know what? i want to take a leap of faith with you I, and like yeah no nah, no nah, no nah. especially when it comes to um this right here it's like they offer bullshit Whatever it is, it's like they know what the right thing to do is and they need to take a leap of faith, but they never offer what is genuine in order to get this temperance right here to happen. It's like whoever this is just backs out of it. And maybe, Cancer, you feel like you're not going to give your cup here because, at least not naively like you did before, because you'll end up getting yourself hurt by this person again because it's really not like they offer much of anything at all. Like, shit, they cause people to walk away. And then they want to come slow when it comes to offering shit. And then they just run like a little bitch whenever the opportunity strikes up. Because it's like, whatever it is they want to offer up, it's like, it always turns to shit. Then now they got to do the right thing and take the leap of faith almost. But it's like, they offer shit. They offer shit in order to get this started. And then it's like, oh, well, that, that didn't work, so I'm just going to run away. But they're not really coming with it quick enough to or they're not coming at all like they always turn around so that's kind of weird let's just lay some in well okay never mind <laughs> they're burdened because someone had a mouth <laughs> better than this night with the page of wands is being way too immature with their shit someone's burdened because they got a mouth because they're a little bit too insecure for their own good i feel like they hang on to stuff they find too valuable and uh that's what's got them really sad because they kind of want to work on things i feel like make home home like this is start with this reverse and i feel like this person wants to make it right i really do um might be done with an earth sign capricorn taurus or virgo most likely taurus because you know they always purse their lips and duck lips um Cancer, you might just not like them, or some shit, or they, or, 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 or I don't know. It's like, who's jealous here? And this person's trying to, sh almost like trying to show you what they're doing. It just puts you in a sour mood. Like, it's weird. Yeah, it's, I, I like, I don't know. Like, and here's the Eight of Swords. It, it's like going down. It's like. It's like someone's all mad because they ain't got out of that nasty headspace yet, but they got money, so it's like, I don't know. Or maybe you're upset or somebody is upset with you because, like, you know, someone's already set. They're just like, you know what? Like, you can have your ten of pentacles. I'm a goddamn king. You go do what you want to do. And that's just got, like, somebody in their feelings like, mmm, because they want to get out of that negative headspace, I feel like. Cancer? I don't know. I don't know if this is you. I guess I cross watch or switch where you need to. That's what it feels like a little bit. All right. Scorpio, it is your shadows. Turn. Ah, you totally took a nap. I don't know. I might be a little bit late with, like, the uh, mid-monthlies as well, just letting you guys know, because, like, I'm changing jobs. Right? And, I'm, and I gotta do, like, a few different shifts. Everything's going to be switched around, but I'm going to try to keep schedule as best as possible, so no worries. I just got to remember to do shit instead of, like, forget, like I always do, because I'm a procrastinating bitch. Anyway, Scorpio, it is your turn, my loves. Let's see. What's coming up for your Shadow of Judgment this week? Give you a nice, good shuffle. Let the winds of faith decide what happens to you and how you will strive to overcome them and such. 
Ah, uh, well, here's booty card, man. So, or booty man card. I always end up mixing up the words, but that's because I'm like dumb. Oh, well. Let's see. And working things out. Ooh, all right, like this dude could be running from this shit, but it's like, mm, where, why? Everyone's just stressing some shit. Uh, someone's feeling left out in the cold. Okay, wait, what? Ah, uh, hold on. I gotta look at this for a second, because I'm like, mm, what do you mean? Like, why? Someone is running away. From what I feel like is a partnership that I feel like is a liability. Or just too much effort to actually, like, get out of this, uh... Five of Pentacles energy. Because, like, that would require them to go down to the Three of Pentacles. It's almost like, uh, uh, fuck this shit, I'm out. I am not losing any more money trying to work any more shit with you, almost. But it's not like it, it didn't work. It's not like the cards are reversed. It's like, this person isn't giving it a, any attempt to try. Or they aren't putting their energy, they'll put their energy to anything else but that, I think. At least that's what I'm picking up from this. But that's what it feels like. It, like, like they're just running away. Like, you know, like, I want to go gamble somebody where else instead of, like, actually work on something with somebody. And we got, like, a little counselor right here. People are, look, took notes about, look, look, I love him, but he leaves the toilet up and I fall into it every night. And he's just like, well, you know that, like, the toilet's there. Why don't you put the seat down? Why do I always got to put the seat up for you? When are you ever going to put the seat up? For me, you know, I have, I know my worth, you know, and, and then you're just going back and forth on this stuff. Like, it's just kind of like, and this counselor's just like, oh, okay. But it's like this person ran away from it because they didn't want to put, I think, put the money into it or put the effort into it to try to get both people or both parties out of this. Like, look, because they're, because this bitch is actually wearing the same outfit. I mean, that's just the snow. Either way, she's got this and it's like, she tries to fix this shit, but it's like, dude here, like, somehow comes up with the money to get, like, a knight outfit and go riding on a freaking horse. Wherever he got that from, we don't know, because it's fire. So it could have been anything. <laughs> could be a lawnmower for all we really know. Yeah, they, they just completely gave up on it. You know. Even though I think that this would have been a victory for both parties, Scorpio. Um, and the person who's the emperor right here, who's looking back on this, like, you guys get him a lot, I will say. You always deal with a fire sign, but damn it, you guys are always in your fucking energy when it comes to this emperor. I've never, I, I rarely ever get you guys actually, um, being out of that emperor element, so kudos to you, man. But it's like, you're looking over this person, and it's like, you have a little bit more control. Because I feel like this is more like you because you guys get the Emperor so much, I think. At least I believe it's you guys that always get the Emperor. Yeah! Yeah, you're just looking at this dude like, you know what, I remember back in the day. I feel like I've read this for you actually before, Scorpio. Yeah, all the all the choices were dead because of this. Um, I think you, yeah, you don't have any idea what the hell happened, Scorpio, this week. You're just like, what the fuck? What the- oh god, and, then, and now they want to mean mug you. Like, you're an emperor and they're a king. A shitty king. And they're coming over here trying to say some shit. You know? You were looking for a ba- okay, you were looking for a balance because this has been bugging you for a while. Scorpio, like, this person left not wanting to fight for anything because, like, they were tired of losing the head games with you. And so they just- keep judging you and looking at you like a dick like how is it fair to be fair in this situation like I'm the king but it's like they don't recognize that like even when you were in rags and riches trying to get shit started trying to gain a victory and only finding out that there was no real options and trying to make fairness that you were the emperor and the sad thing is it's like you're not even sure what the fuck their problem is like you have no fucking clue like, they won the games that they were playing, but now it's like they're all upset that, like, you walked away because you don't want to play these games. It's like, it's ridiculous to you how it goes. 
Um, what is this thing uh, Juan's mad at you for? Like, he ran away as a knight while you were fucking broke. You became an emperor. They only became a, 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 a king, and now they're looking at you like, you know, they deserve something because you got right in your pocket or they think that everybody else has like it better than them or whatnot and you should be giving to them and you're all confused you, you're like that chick from like the Real Housewives of New Jersey and that confused cat meme you're just looking at them like what What are you talking about like why are you why, why are you screaming at me bitch the hell <laughs> You know, yeah, they're all like bitter and upset. Like they want to turn her back to you, but they're still kind of looking over. Like, mm. they want to walk away despite the fact that their cups are full, and they're still keeping a really nasty attitude. With okay, well, whatever. I don't need them in my hand. Still keeping a nasty attitude. Or they might try to put you in a bad attitude, but don't worry. Justice says nothing's gonna start up in this situation. So I think it's like rejection is God's protection at this point. Like they might be mad that like you come up and like you're giving to people and they think that you should give to them more with these six of pentacles. I think they're in that position just because it's like they're on a lower status than you. But they're not as low as other people, but they notice the red in these people's pockets and are just like, well, you know, well, they got this and they got that and I've got nothing. When in reality, they got exactly what they've been, they went out and got. Like, they went out as a fucking knight immaturely, and now they want to come back when they realize that you have more, Scorpio. And that's really leaving you to understand that, that, that the victory you're getting is not giving this any... Seeing this as no other options in this, and realizing that it, it's okay for this stuff not to begin, I feel like. So that's your shadow, Scorpio, for this coming week. Interesting, interesting stories. All right, Pisces, you're up, my loves. It's good to see. I wonder if I should tell my husband to like come home. Well, I don't know if he has the card. I'm probably gonna order food because I'm that kind of bitch. Now, yeah, that's what I'm gonna do. I'm gonna order food. I need to get some of the zodiacs done today too. That way, I, my schedule isn't too crazy. Let's see, Scor oh not Scorpio, Pisces. You're weak. You're last, as always, but that's okay. We always like saving the best for last after all. So we'll just pinch them cheeks, make it go squeaky squeak and like do your little shadow right here. Right? Right. Anyway, let's see. Boop. We got you feeling all good. Chilling on your own enjoying things as they are um you're looking over your own emotional cup you got it covered but you are examining it pretty well be like do i really want to open this bitch or you know should i just enjoy this money i got here i'm like so close to being empress right or someone wants to do that to you give you a little bit out of their cup you know because this is a young empress this nine of pentacles right here this is her when she's younger and just fucking around teaching birds how to hold apples on their heads because it, it, that's all she's got to do like she, she ain't got to do much else um, she ain't offering shit <laughs> she's just like nope I'm not giving you one of my pentacles I don't give a fuck how much you try to offer me a cup up right this person over here and this isn't you Pisces like you're trying to recover a little bit now the person offering this cup might just lose their shit because you know it's just like I deserve that cup right like feeling out in the elements or you feel like you're left out in the cold or maybe you feel like if you give out these pentacles um it's gonna put you in a dire strait of sorts because like they could be coming to love you up and they're and you're just like i'm not giving you any money um i'll go broke trying to deal with your ass and then they just lose their shit just being like what do you mean you're gonna go broke with me i'm trying to offer you my cup what the fuck I mean, air sign you're dealing with, Libra, Gemini, Aquarius. Uh, you might be recognizing that there's nasty behaviors. And, you, yeah, you might be recovering from this, how it left you bitter and such, right? Temperance. King of Swords. Mm. I don't think someone likes the Empress. I think he's like being he's being I like to say that he's judgmental and he's reversed in this deck and it's like he kind of has like reserved judgments about her. 
Pisces, I feel like whoever you're dealing with, if this is not you, I feel like had a lot of bad behaviors that kind of came out when you started trying to fix yourself when you got in the element of the Empress Reverse. It's like when you got a little older, you were a bit bitter about things, but like that's because like back in the day, it seems like you get you you refused to give your pentacle out to somebody. Because you knew that like they would keep you as a liability if you joined with them in holy cup ramoni. That was a stupid word. Never mind. But it was cool for a second. It sounded cool in my head. Anyway. But it was like It's almost like off this like either you offered this cup was a completely irrational decision where it just made you feel like you had to lose your shit for a bit, right? And that was a bad behavior. Or this is a person that you're dealing with, this queen and this page could be the same person doesn't have to be right but it's like they try to offer their cup to you and then you realize how nuts they were and it just took a minute it took a minute of dealing with their enabling behaviors but you figured it out right and now it's like they want to judge you harshly as like you're examining yourself to try to figure out how to heal yourself in this in order to get away from being the angry empress because i think you don't want to go into your actual divine throne uh, being total bitch mode right that's never good and this person's almost like underneath of you judging you for it too what is this king of wands's problem you know what is their dealio 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 Oh, they got their own uh, issue. <laughs> they got their own problem. That's the problem. They got their own problem, and they, they, I, they got problems, but they want to make sure it's your problems too. Uh, particularly in the overindulgence to the point where you get sick kind of way. It's like they wasted time, did a whole bunch of like naughty shit, tried to get away with shit. Uh, third party situation as well. I, I, like, eh. Ew, very dealing with Pisces, like, they're not really cool. Not at all. Like, they tried sneaking away and not offer any sort of apology at all. But still want to be looked at like they got some authority in something. Either in the church, either in the classroom, either in the streets, either with peoples, either with their community, friends, whatever. It's all just a fucking game to this person you're dealing with here. Is expecting you to... I don't know, help them out, I guess, but no, that, that, that's not how it works. That's not how it works. And then they don't know what to do. So they try to leave. So they try to, like, juggle the idea of, you know, like, hey, should I just leave or should I try to stick around? Right? But it's not like they're offering their cup anyway. And even if they did, you're not offering it either because you know that it'd be an enemy in your house. And you are on the nose with that shit, I believe. Like, you're definitely examining ever, all in, every and all information you can gather before anything else happens. So That's your shadow, water signs. Good deal. If you all enjoyed this video, please like, share, subscribe. If that's what you want to do, I would greatly appreciate it. But, like, no pressure, of course. All up to you, really. But I will see you guys later. You take it easy. Love your faces and bye-bye.